In this example, I have already entered several histamine receptor DNA sequences from different organisms. Megaline's four pairwise alignment methods are disabled until we select at least two sequences by control or command clicking or shift clicking on their names in the work table. If we select additional sequence names, all possible pairwise combinations will be aligned, each pair in a separate window. In this example, we'll just choose the histamine receptor sequence for chimpanzee and human. Now that I've made my selections, I need to choose an alignment method. By going to the Align method and choosing one pair, we can view the available pairwise alignment methods. Because this project contains only DNA sequences, the Wilbur Lippmann, Martinez, Needleman, Wunsch, and dot plot methods are enabled. As we can see from this table, the best pairwise alignment methods for internally repetitive sequences are Martinez, Needleman, Wunsch, and dot plot. If the chosen sequences are divergent or of unknown ancestry, or if both sequences are similar in length, we recommend using the Wilbur Lippmann method with a small k tuple chosen in the method parameters. In our example here, our sequences are both closely related, being chimpanzee and human, and very different in length. Therefore, the Martinez Needleman Wunsch method is definitely the best choice for us. After I go to align one pair by Martinez Needleman Wunsch method, the method parameters dialog opens automatically. In this case, I'll leave the parameters at their defaults and click OK to begin the alignment. And here's our finished pairwise alignment for DNA. For proteins, or for mixed protein and DNA sequences, the available choices are Lippmann Pearson and dot plot. As you can see from this table, Lippmann Pearson is recommended if you don't need to do an exhaustive global alignment. Otherwise, dot plot is the best choice. Megalign provides four multiple sequence alignment methods, which are available for all sequence types and for any number of sequences. These are the Jotun Hein and the Clustal V methods, and two different varieties of the Clustal W method fast approximate and slow accurate. The two versions of Clustal W are selected using the command align method parameters. The fast approximate version of Clustal W is intermediate in speed and accuracy between the Clustal V and the slow accurate Clustal W methods. If you need to use Clustal W for large numbers of sequences, and you also want to set the ends of your sequences based on how they align, consider doing the following. First, select all of the sequences using Control A or Command A, then use Clustal V for the initial alignment. Next, select the entire consensus by dragging and set the ends of the Clustal V Align sequences using the Align Create Alignment from Selection command. Save the project with the desired title and generate the final alignment from this new project using Clustal W set to Slow Accurate. And here is the resulting phylogenetic tree for our multiple alignment. The Megaline Help, which can be accessed via the Help Contents command, gives tips for choosing an appropriate alignment method. If you have further questions about choosing an alignment method in Megaline, or have questions about any of our other software, please visit us online at www.dnastar.com or contact us at support at dnastar.com.